everyone, welcome. I am r 35 Addict and welcome to my own car's YouTube channel. And today we are going to be taking a look at the brand new 2016 Focus RS. Here it is. side of the RS. Um, first impressions I think it looks great um, but uh, let me just get onto the sound. The sound of this car um, surprisingly is, um, is, is amazing. Um, to the older RS um, I don't think it's as, uh, as good as the older RS but um, if you get an aftermarket exhaust on this I think I think it could be up there with the, with the older RS but uh, I don't think many uh, cars in the last RS's category kind of beats it, but um, this is really nice. Nice feel to the steering wheel. Um, RS logo, got nice blue contrasting, exactly the same colour on the outside. On the inside, um, these bucket seats, it, they hold you very well. Um, I'm not an in-depth reviewer, so don't expect me to go over everything. I'm not really too sure what I'm talking about half the time. Um, but these bucket seats are really nice, got like a nice suede kind of like feel to them. Um, but yeah, the exterior, as you've just seen, is remarkable. It looks better than better than the older RS, in my opinion. Um, obviously, this is for pure for pure drivers, drivers' cars, um, car people, driver car people. You know, it's focused on the manual gearbox. No, you know, crappy paddles. I did say, no auto in this car. Um, but yeah, I wouldn't mind owning one of these. Um, really, really nice. I'll take you on, um, on an end tour. A tour of the interior now. Okay, so this is the interior of the new Focus RS, as I said. The stitching on the steering wheel is exactly the same colour on the outside. The RS logo there. There's your centre console. It's really nice. I've never sat in the old RS, so I can't compare the interior. Um, some nice boost gauges up there. And there are the bucket seats. They do look really nice and they hold you in very well. Same in the back. Looks very comfy there in the back. Recaro seats, obviously. 